This morning, I picked up this Platoon 2 by Kokoda Caravans to show you what this caravan's all about. Now, this is their mid to high end, rough road going couples van. Now, I haven't stepped inside this caravan before, so it's going to be a bit of a surprise for me as well. Just need to find somewhere to set myself up. Well, I'm all set up and it's time to take a closer look at the Platoon 2 by Kokoda Caravans. One of the first things that I noticed was the amount of storage that you've got on this caravan. Love the fact that you've got this large checker plate storage box on the A-frame. There are two slide outs, one on the offside and one on the near side. And that's gonna suit, you know, a large portable fridge, maybe a generator, who knows, maybe even a barbecue. But to be honest, you're probably not gonna need a barbecue because Kokoda can fit as an option this premium Dometic slide out kitchen. Now the Dometic slide out kitchen is all self-supporting. It's literally just a matter of sliding it out. One thing that I noticed though, is that the hot and cold water lines are permanently plumbed, so no need to connect them separately. You will need, however, to connect the gas line to the supplied gas bayonet. The Platoon 2 sits on a six inch chassis with a two inch riser. You've got a six inch drawbar as well, and that runs all the way back to the Elko Cross Country 2.0 suspension system. Kokoda uses Moranti timber for the framing, and that's clad with this smooth gray composite aluminium and let's not forget that black protective checker plate. The interior is undeniably classy, comprising a forward queen size bed with full wardrobe, a comfortable near side dinette, a complete offside kitchen, and all the features you'd expect. The 12 volt system is comprised of two 100 amp hour deep cycle batteries mounted to the offside chassis rail. Two 170 watt solar panels are mounted to the roof. There's even a BM Pro battery management system inside one of the kitchen's overhead lockers. Two 95 litre water tanks are fitted, as is a grey water tank. All right, so it looks like there's a reasonable amount of storage space above this dinette. One thing that I like, piano hinges that are used. That just, to me, makes it nice and sturdy. And not only do you have some overhead lockers here in the kitchen, more storage space, this time for the pantry. Look at this. A couple of shelves up there, another shelf, and this little slide out pantry. That's heaps of room for all your bits and pieces for when you're traveling around Australia. All right, let's check out the bathroom. I mean, huge linen cupboard. One thing that I'm really noticing about this caravan is the amount of storage space that it provides. Fortunately, this caravan comes with a payload capacity to match. Now, this Kokoda Platoon 2 weighs roughly 2,600 kilos tear. It has an ATM of 3,300 kilos, and that equates to a payload capacity of 700 kilograms. Well, that is a quick look at the Platoon 2 by Kokoda Caravans. Really, what else is there to do but jump in the car and return this caravan. Although to be perfectly honest, I'd really rather just hit the road, head north for the winter.